Hey what's up guys welcome to another tutorial of PHP for beginner series and in this video we will be learn about PHP session variables in PHP so i want to tell you that why PHP session variables are used if you define a variable in your index.php file and you try to access that variable in this section PHP shows me an error message so you can see that here is a variable a and i assign value 5 to this variable and when i go to register.php and in register.php i try to echo this variable so go to your browser and type here after cubic soul register.php you can you can see that it shows me an error message that undefined variable a it means that if you define a variable in your index.php file so you can only access that variable in your index.php file you cannot access this variable in another files so where php sessions comes in so let me talk about how to create a session first of all you have to go on the absolute top of your page before html tag you have to start your php tag and you have to close your php tag and in this section you have to type session start semicolon now our session has been start php session is start on the absolute beginning in the page because before html tag and now in this section after php i will assign a with a variable like dollar underscore s e double s i o n and in the parentheses i want to give a uh, name of my variable like uh, favorite color f e a v c o l o r so this name of our session is favorite color is equal to i type here red press semicolon now our session is set which is named favorite color and red value is assigned to this variable so if i want to access this value now you have to go to your register.php file and here first of all remove this and you have to again start your session with this keyword so in the next section if you want to echo you can you can see that you have to type dollar underscore s e double s i o n session and in this type you have to give your variable name which you were given in index.php f a v c o l o r so copy it and paste it into register.php file and press control s save and open your browser first of all this is index.php so you can see that it echo a because i did not save index.php file now i save it and open your browser and refresh it you can see that it disappeared now i want access that values in my register.php file so you can see that it shows me red so if you want to change the value of your variable so you have to type here like in the red you have to place green and press control s save and first of all you have to run your index.php file by clicking on here now you can see that our index.php file is run now after this i again type here register.php so you can see that the value of our color has been changed so this was the method to create and store a value in session you can makes any number of session variables and store any value values between them like integer and string like i store string value green in my session variable and now i want to tell you that how to where the actual working of session variables when you create a website you need to login functionality in your website you cannot create a login login functionality without session variables session variables are used to create login functionality in your website so now i want to tell you that how to destroy this session to destroy this session simply go to your register.php file and type here session underscore session underscore unset semicolon press control s save and refresh your browser so you can see that now our session has been unset successfully and it shows me an error message because session is unset and it shows me that undefined index favorite color now our interpreter did not rec recognize that what is variables means because we have been destroy our session variable so this was a session variable in php and if you have any question you can ask us in the comment section or directly whatsapp us and like this video and share this video with you those friends who want to learn php and especially who are interested in programming and they are beginners and in the next uh, uh, some days we are going to uh, give you a comprehensive course on android development so stay tuned with us and uh, like this video and uh, finally thanks for watching